Hello everybody, welcome to a brand new video. Uh, today's video is going to be a bit different. Instead of talking uh, about shit I just don't like or think is stupid, we're going to be talking about something a little bit more positive today. Something I actually do like and I, I find enjoyment out of. Today we're going to be talking about the uh, the YouTube channel Diesel Patches. Uh, Diesel Patches has uh, lately been just kind of doing incredibly well on this channel. Uh, if you want a bit of context, uh, January 26th of last year, he had made a 200,000 subscriber special. It's now October 14th. He has almost 800,000 subscribers. In a year, or uh, more than a year, he has almost quadrupled his sub count, which is awesome. Now, there are a few specific reasons on why I really like his channel, and I just want to go into that. Because, and honestly, I just feel like this channel is very underrated, and I feel like a lot of the time it does get some shit. Like, I know that people really enjoy his videos, and there are genuine fans of his channel, but I also feel like there are a lot of haters, and just a lot of people just talking shit about him. I just want to go over a few reasons why I, I, I genuinely uh, just just love this channel and respect this YouTuber. Uh, so let's get started. Let's just go into a, a pretty simple topic of uh, of, of a, why I enjoy this channel. It's just that he's, he's very funny. There's a lot of commentary YouTubers out there. Uh, usually they all have the same kind of style. They usually uh, react or talk about some form of event or video that happens, or a person that that's just under fire lately. However, there's a big difference about uh, a certain, you know, a certain commentary channels and you know other ones that are just better, like Diesel Patches. Uh, and that is just they are a lot funnier than other commentary channels. Also, they don't talk about the generic shit that's happening on the screen. It's not like Azzy Land or Quebble Cop where they just kind of say one word, you know, react, you know, say one word, oh that's cool, or, or fucking narrate the video. Diesel Patches gives his opinions on why he doesn't like it. He, he explains his reasoning for not liking something and he goes in depth about certain parts that he just doesn't like at all. But I digress from the main point, uh, his comedy is another thing that really gets me. Now obviously this is a subjective thing, obviously everybody has uh, different tastes in comedy. Uh, Diesel Patch is one who kind of does rely on dark humor, which isn't a bad thing in my opinion. I enjoy a lot of dark humor. It tickles my funny bone, so to speak. But the way he does this comedy is just, it's just good. I mean, he doesn't, he doesn't try and force anything. You know, it, it, it all kind of flows and just goes together with the video when you listen and just watch it. Again, it's not like these generic YouTubers who just try really hard to, to do or say something funny. He just kind of does it, and it happens naturally. Instead of, again, like others who do it artificially. Alright, so the next uh, big reason for why I enjoy Diesel Patch's content is actually because of the content itself. While most commentary channels, I feel like, don't always go into depth about a person or, like, a single person or a video. They usually go into depth about events that have happened or, you know, something something that's going on in the world or, or something, someone who did something stupid. I found that Diesel Patches, on the other hand, doesn't really go that route. While he does go into video topics that other people make, he does generally go into the to the the channel and the the YouTuber themselves or the or the content creator themselves. He usually criticizes like just a, just like a small handful of their videos, talking about why he doesn't like them or why he thinks they're cringy or why they're not funny. Or sometimes he just talks about what a singular person does. Or did, like for example, how he's made a couple of videos about Pokemon when she was under fire, or more recently how he's made a couple of videos on Mini Lad, for one to touch the little peepees of little boys. And again, this is the reason I really like his content. It's a bit different from other commentary channels because they feel like a lot of other commentary channels, they go more for like the bigger, broader topics, you know, like the big things that's happening in like today, to like the big people, you know, big things that are just going on in the world. While Diesel Patches does that sometimes, it really he really doesn't always go into the big topics. He usually goes into like specific people that he just doesn't like. He doesn't go into these really obnoxious and crazy topics that always happen around the world. But instead he always goes into the topics of, you know, these idiot people and these unfunny content creators on the platform that he just doesn't like. Or shitty things that these platform uh, platform that these content creators have done. Which segues into my uh, my third and my my final big point of why I just generally like his channel. It's because he's not afraid of what he's doing. He, he's not afraid to say or do something. 
and he's not afraid to voice his opinion and call people out on their stupid bullshit. I mean, there are countless examples of him just calling people out on their stupidity, you know? He's called out the, uh, you know, he's called out H3H3, Pokimane, iDubs, Minilad, he's called out a lot of people just on the things they've done, but he also calls out on the, uh, the things that he just doesn't like, you know? The, the channels that he thinks are just genuinely unfunny and kind of cringy and boring, you know, like Lily Singh, uh, Lily Pons, and those, you know, and so on. And again, this is generally why I like and respect his his content and his channel altogether. It's because he's not afraid to just voice his opinion. You know, he 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 talks about you know some big YouTubers. He talks about some some small ones. He talks about like a topic or like a, a type of video that people like, and he voices his opinion. But he doesn't care what people think. He doesn't care about the backlash. He just wants to voice his opinion, and he makes it into a video. And it's not like he gets backlash, he's made a couple of videos where he even talks about, like, the hate comments that he gets from talking about specific YouTubers and their videos. Here's an example, uh, his video reading more hate comments from Lily Singh's fan base. This was based off his video when he, he made the video called Lily Singh is a massive hypocrite, you know, which is absolutely true. And she calls, and she, uh, he calls her out for being a massive hypocrite for the entire video. And again, it's completely true when you watch the video and you just listen to his points and you just see what happened. But he doesn't care about the backlash and he's gotten a lot of hate comments from it. And there were a lot of people who just genuinely didn't enjoy the video and didn't like it because of his opinion. But again, he didn't care. He even made a video just talking about the hate comments and just flat out debunking their cases that they even made against Diesel Patches or just, you know, talking about the mean, mean stuff that they said about him. Well, that's going to do it for this video. Uh, make sure you guys hit that, uh, com uh, you guys go subscribe or whatever, I don't care. You hit that, go type a comment. Uh, Diesel Patch is just a, a channel I just genuinely respect. And I didn't say this in the video, or at least I don't think I did, and I probably should have. But, uh, he's like, he's one of my biggest inspirations for starting commentary videos. And just finding real enjoyment out of making them and, you know, uploading them to YouTube. And I just want to say, if this video happens to get views, which it probably won't, go ahead and check out his channel if you haven't. I'm sure you probably have if you're part of the commentary community, and you're watching my shit. But if you're not, go ahead. He's a cool channel, and he's a cool dude, and I really respect his videos, and him. Uh, thanks for watching. Uh, Diesel Patches, if you watch this, keep doing you. Don't change your videos, you know, just keep doing what you're doing, man. Uh, see you guys in the next one.